Blue 42! Hut! Hut! <laughs> Hey everybody, I'm Greg Bedard, the NFL writer at the Boston Globe, here with former Patriots tight end Jermaine Wiggins, and we are going inside the Patriots playbook with a look at Sunday's opponent, Jermaine, uh, the Miami Dolphins. First time we've seen them this season, mm -hmm. a whole new, you know, Joe Philbin, new head coach, mm -hmm. Mike Sherman, a new offensive coordinator. Uh, they're five and six. They're still in the playoff race. This is a big game for them, and they have a rookie quarterback in Ryan Tannehill, who's pretty good, but... The Dolphins obviously know they need to run the ball to do well, which they did. 23 carries for 147 yards on Sunday against a Seahawks defense that is really good against yep. the runs. The Patriots didn't even want to run against them. That's how good they are. And they got them pretty good, including this 22-yard uh, touchdown from uh, Reggie Bush on a neat little shotgun play that you don't see very often. Yeah, and I, and I think when you look at the Patriots defense, I think one thing that we're starting to see from them, they're not as stout or as solid mm -hmm. on the defensive front, especially against the run that we've seen early in the season. So if you're the Miami Dolphins, you want to attack them. And I think the one thing that we heard Bill Belichick say on sound effects is we got to be able to set the edge, control the edge. And clearly here, Seattle doesn't do a good job of that. What they do is they run like an inside trap play. And what they do is they down block the offensive guard here. And then they take the, the left tackle and they climb him to the second level. They take the safety. They seal, this, they seal the strong safety. So what they want to do is kind of create a wall here where they want to be able to outflank, cut the defense in half, pin, pin all three pin blocks right here and now what they want to do with this defensive end and you'll, you'll see the fullback here he wants to cut that outside leg get him down on the ground they do a good job of pulling the center he now looks for the first force here who is the defensive back kicks him out they get it to Reggie Bush on an inside handoff and that creates a nice running lane right here but it was a well blocked play it was a great down block here you see uh, I think it's Long who climbs to the second level does a nice job was it Long or Thomas? The left tackle. That is, that is long. Long, yep. long. He does a great job of climbing to the second level. W wide receiver does a tremendous job because the safety starts down in the box, comes down here, pins him inside, fullback cuts the outside leg of that uh, right defensive end, and then you'll see Ponzi pull around, kick out the DB, and there's just a nice running lane. And by the time Reggie Bush gets touched, he's at like the four or five yard line. So well, well he designed play, but they executed, executed, and I think that's the one thing you'll see them do against the Patriots. Yeah, I think the Patriots have had a couple problems mm -hmm. of late. Um, one with Kyle Love uh, mm -hmm. at tackle. He's been getting shoved out of his gap. And then on the ends, Chandler Jones has been pretty good, and I think he's going to be back yeah. on Sunday. We'll see. He's been pretty good for the most part, but of late, he started to peak. And on this yeah. play, you saw Clemens kind of peak to the inside. He was done at that point. Ninkovich has done that on occasion. These guys are really going to have to be careful about their technique in this game. If they, they can't get the edge, and we've seen this of late with the Patriots defense, they've been giving up explosive runs in the, uh, in the running game, and an explosive run is 12 or more yards. So 12-plus mm -hmm. yards, and we've seen teams get, get some explosive runs yeah, on them. Including the Jets. And if, yep. if the Patriots, you know, with a rookie quarterback, they're going to want to Stop the run, yep. put them in long down in uh, yardage situations, and then that's when turnovers can yep. happen. We saw Tannehill throw a couple uh, against Seattle, so the yep. Patriots have been rolling with turnovers. This is what they're going to need to do to keep it going. Good, so. my, good defense, too, for Miami, so that, that's why yep. they want to run play fail position and play to our defense because we have a rookie back here. Yep, sounds good. All right, thanks, Jermaine. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in. We'll see you next week on Inside the Playbook.